Today I'm going to be sharing with you the Bohemian Brights Be Happy Box. All right, let's get to it. If you are new here, welcome. I'm Tina, and if you are returning, welcome back. Thank you so much for joining me in another video. All right, this is really exciting. I entered a contest through the Happy Planner. Big prize was winning tickets for Go Wild. And then there were other winners that would win the new Be Happy Box at the time, the Life Hack Pack. And um, I won the box. I'm so excited about this. Um, obviously, the Go Wild tickets are really what I was going for, but I was just really excited that I won this because it's always really exciting to win things. And I did ask them for the Bohemian Brights uh, Be Happy box. Now I do have to disclose to you that this box actually is no longer available. I'm checking it right now as I'm filming it. According to this, it's saying that it is sold out. Now I don't know if it is going to be restocked. I'm not privy to that information, but there was another life box that was also released at the same time that this one was, and that one is the Apricot Dreams, and that one is still available. So I will put a picture of that one up here for you. So if you like the contents in this box and you're interested in getting it, then um, you might want to pick up the Apricot Dream uh, Life Hack be happy box. I don't know why that's like such a tongue twister for me. All right, let's go ahead and open this up. Honestly, this has been sitting on my desk for a minute now because I was sick last week and just so much was going on and I just did not have the opportunity to open this up. And of course, I wanted to share it with you and film it. So let's go ahead and take a look here. I'm going to Clear this. Oh, it's really pretty on the inside. I like the colors. Generally, something like this bright and this aesthetic is not really my thing, but I um I don't know. It's just I really, really like it. So this is already ripped, so I'm just gonna keep ripping it here. I don't know if you notice I didn't even point out, but on the outside of the box, it did actually tell us what is in here. So there's a lot of things in here which are pretty exciting. Like this is a pretty substantial box. Um, it's like really hefty. All right, let's go ahead, take a look. You can see how it comes. Oh, this is really pretty. I really do like the colors. Live in the present. And on the back side here, this card has got everything that is in the box. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to scoop everything out and then go through each thing with you in detail. There are a total of seven items in this box. So I'm just going to kind of put this to the side and we'll go through each thing here. To start off, we have this accessory, which is a pen holder. And I, I like these. I've had these before and I think it's really cute. It's like this elasticized band that goes around your planner. And then it does have the little area here for you to slide a pen in. So let me just, I'm just grabbing a pen here just to kind of show you um, how that works. So it's really cute. I do like these bands. These are really kind of nice and useful to have. There is a sticker book. Okay, we'll look at that in just a few minutes because of course that will be one of the last things we look at. Okay, so this right here, we've got a dry erase vision board and then it comes with decals. All right, let's go ahead and open this up. Ooh, this is really pretty. And then here's the back of it. I like the colors. Make it happen. It's got like a section here, three sections. It's got a checklist. Here you could probably put like a sticker in there or a decal. Here are the decals. Okay, those are always a little tricky to get out of the packaging because of course they're sticky. Oh, there's two sheets. Oh, that's really cute. Okay, so like you could probably take one of these let's see all right it's got the little decal and it should like stick on there but that's cute now let's take a look here yeah that stays on there nicely i like that that is a really 
cute idea. Make it happen. Uh, progress, dreams, plans, notes, dream it, plan it, little wins. This is really cute. Details, checklist, um, start here, finish here. Here's the plan. I'm just kind of reading things randomly. You got this. This is big. This is really cute. And of course, it goes into your a classic size planner. It does have a tab there, so that's nice. Okay, I am going to actually grab the planner next because the other items are inserts and it's gonna just make more sense if I show the, you the planner first. It's packaged really nicely, I like this. Um, I feel like it's really important when you receive anything that things come through nicely packaged. We're ordering these things online, of course, and we wanna make sure that we get them in good shape. Ooh, these are pretty. Ooh, I had forgotten what the, that these discs are metal discs. Let's see here. Yeah, those feel like metal discs. Okay, so here is the cover. Um, it's got a little uh, saying here. It says dream big. Very pretty. Okay, we've got the inside, which is pretty. It's soft. I actually think I like the inside a little bit better than the outside. Um, and then... Let's get this off. Okay, so this is an undated planner. If you are not familiar with the undated planners from Happy Planner, you do get uh, a little sticker sheet here with the months, and you get two of each. That way you can go ahead and label your uh, tabs on the front and the back, and this is a gold foil font. Happy planner, this planner belongs to. And then of course, there it's just gonna jump right in because it's undated, so obviously you're not gonna have your calendar pages at the beginning of the planner. So here we are with our currently page or our notes page prior to the month. So we've got three priorities, an important grid section, take note, which is lined. And then this one says, actually I can. So you've got a nice little affirmation here. And then here is the first tab. Okay, let's go in and take a look at each month and the layout. Um, and we've got our monthly here. On this side, we've got a grid section for notes. And then there is some little detailing here at the spine. Let's go in here. Oh, okay, so here we've got set goals for this month. So we're gonna want to set a goal, action steps. Three is reflect. Um, and then we have um, another area. So basically, the concept is to set two goals for yourself for the month. And I think that that is definitely something that is obtainable and it doesn't feel so overwhelming. So I do like that and I like that um, it's prompting us, telling us what to do. The space isn't super big so you don't feel like really overwhelmed by it. Things to follow up on. So here we would go ahead and fill in. So you've got a shaded heading area and then a checklist with bullet points to check off. And there's the four boxes. Now we're jumping into the first week here. Ooh, I really like this. I don't think I have ever had a planner um, with a vertical layout an hourly before. Um, I know I've seen them and I've contemplating getting them, but I really like this. So we've got a focus box up here. We've got a daily habits that you could put here with a little note. It's important to dedicate time to take care of yourself to boost productivity. Yes, absolutely. All right, so here is the little section that you would write your daily habit in. And then we've got a little grid, like dot grid. There's a note section here. Then of course, we've got the vertical layout from Monday through Sunday. We've got a blank box at the top, which you could put like an affirmation in there, a sticker, or maybe the top thing that is happening for the day that you need to know about. Um, you have your habits here, or really whatever you wanna put there. You can obviously make it your own. And then we have an hourly here from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. and it is actually uh, like one box 
for each hour. So you don't have like half hour increments in here, but I do like that because they're taking that space up and they're giving us this extra room up here for those other things. I like this, this is really nice. Okay, so we've got the same thing and this one is like kind of like that peachy tone. Um, now let's go ahead and take a look here. So we've got, yeah, we've got quite a few weeks in here since it's undated. So it gives us actually six weeks. That's a lot. Yeah, I just wanted to confirm that. Yeah, that's six weeks of undated in here. So, you know, obviously some months are longer than others and you could kind of format it however you want like that. Okay, now we're going into the next month and let's go ahead. So we do have a little bit different down here. Um, and it looks like this color is also different. Let's go back here for a moment. So let's slow down and take a look at the details in here. Yeah, so that's like a peachy. And then this one, we have a soft like lavender. Here is the um, tab, Dream Big. This is the same as the cover. And then now we've got little uh, polka dots in here in that lavender color. Ooh, ooh, I like that color. That's that's my jam right there. Very pretty. Okay, so now let's go to the next month and see if it changes color. And it does, but it looks like it goes back to that like peach tone. And this is the same down here as the uh, first month that we saw. Of course, here is the tab. Um, give it all you've got and give it all you've got. It just repeats there around this. I know that this is like Bo Dreams, but I think that this is called something, I'm not quite sure um, what you would call that. If you know, please drop it down in the comments and let me know. I would love to learn. Um, okay, so now we're back to the peach. Yes, so we're gonna alternate here. Yes, we're gonna alternate from the peach to the purple. So now let's just go ahead and take a look at the dividers. And it is 12 months, so here we've got this one. And it's never too late for a fresh start, absolutely. And oh, I like that pink, pretty. Uh, just go all in. Again, we've got the pretty pink and we've got the lavender here. That's pretty. Gratitude is the best attitude. Live in the present. Let today be the start of something new. Follow your dreams pretty and then we've got this last one here with this pattern and let's take a look we've got the notes page which is in like that apricot color actually I can the inside back cover of course and uh, the nice thing is of course is you, I can always switch this around however these discs go really nice with the cover so I would probably just leave it the way that it is so yeah, that's really, really pretty. All right, let's keep looking at the inserts that we have here. So there are three inserts here. There's fitness goals, recipes, and then financial goals. So we've got this beautiful goal planner, and now there's some inserts here to enhance the goal setting. All right, so for the year of, um, fitness goals this month, this quarter, six months, and this year. Oh, pretty. This is why I picked this color because I love purple. So, of course, this is really what got me um, this beautiful purple in here. Uh, we've got weekly progress Monday through uh, Saturday, and then we have a small one here for Sunday because this one is for fitness goals. So I guess they're kind of seen as Sunday is kind of more of a little bit uh, slower day. You're doing different things. Track your habits down here. So this is for one week. Oh, I like that. I like that it's a dot grid in here. So you could go ahead and write whatever you want in there. All right, so there is a pretty substantial amount here. And remember each uh, page here is one week. So like on one actual sheet, we've got like two weeks here with the exception of the first one, which is your goals. And then let's go to the back here. And then we've got a goal getter on the back. 
That's really, really pretty. I really like this. Now, of course, everybody's fitness goals are going to look a little bit different. So I really like that it's pretty open and you can fill it out however you choose. And then this next one here is for recipes. All right, so we've got planning the weekly menu. Um, and then from the kitchen of breakfast ideas, brunch, lunch bites, snacks, main dishes, side dishes, and something new, and baked treats. Okay, let's take a look at this right here. We've got a notes section here. And then good food, shopping list on this side, good mood. Um, then we've got Monday through Sunday, um, where you can write down all of your meals. And it's the same on both sides. So the packs are the same here. So really, this is just, it's a great meal planner. And the first page will give you some ideas of the things that you can then go ahead and plan out for your weekly meal planning. I like the little detailing here on the side. I think that's really pretty. Okay, the next packet we have here is financial goals for the year of uh, next month, next quarter, next six months, and then next year. All right, let's take a look here. Um, vision map. So we've got uh, mapping out for one year out, two, five, and then 10 years. Where do you see yourself? And then here we've got a bill schedule, okay, for the month of, and then of course it's undated and you can fill in whatever month it is. And then it's got this like little shaded box in the corner for you to go ahead and fill in the dates. So there's two months on one side here. Let's see. So we've got four... So we've got for a full year, and then we've got here a debt repayment page. So you would write the account, and then the interest, the beginning balance, the end of the year balance, and then you've got the full month here. So there's one, two, three, four, and there's eight total. Okay, and then this is a savings tracker. So what you are saving for, um, and there's actually two columns here. So you could put on here like your vacation or um, maybe you're saving for your new planner items that you're going to pick up, amount needed, the date you need it by, the starting balance, and then the monthly savings goal. And then you have a tracker here. So you could write the date, what you deposited, and then the balance. And then we've got a four total because there's two on each page here. Ooh, this is a good one. No spend tracker. This will be the month of don't spend on. Okay. And then you've got all of your days here. How did it go this month? So you can go ahead and color those in or check them off however you want to go ahead and account for that. And then there's two of them here. So let's see, two, four. I'm assuming there's a year's worth. Yes, year's worth there. Okay, and then this one is a budget review. So we've got the year income expenses and savings for all of the months. So you can list that in there. And then plan to save. And then we've got some dot grid note pages. I love this because obviously this can be used for whatever you want. Okay, and then here's a little pen holder. You can like put it right at the front here and then you put your pen right in there or you could always use this as like kind of like a page finder. Like let's say you're in a particular week you know, you could bring this like right here and then that way you just flip it open and then that's the week that you're in. So that's a great way for you to use this band as well. So really, really cute. All right, now we've got the sticker book, 886 pieces. So let's see what we have here. We've got some full boxes with deco in them and then some button stickers down the center with all these different like 
affirmations or reminders, do the work, go all in. And those are really pretty. Of course, they all go with the color scheme. Good things will happen. So we've got some double full boxes here. And then we've got some uh, habit trackers for weekly checklists, habit checklist, weekly checklist, and then some noted. All right. What is this? Okay, so these are cute. I like that they used the background here. It makes for a much prettier sticker sheet. And then affirmations, you're killing it. Uh, this is a little rust sticker. Is this a box? Yes, it's a box. We've got some foil in here. It looks like a rose gold. Okay, and then this is clear. Crush it. Be so grateful. Pretty colors, of course, to coordinate. Don't forget, let today be the start of something new. These are pretty, these like kind of like elongated oval stickers. Uh, these are interesting. Now, this looks like a full box, yes, with that at the bottom. That little arch there. Yeah, these are little stickers, but then these are actually longer. Okay, well that's cute because you can use that like on a line. Okay, and then we've got some like shaded in, but it does have some lines in there, so you can use that. These are obviously decorative. And then we've got some headings here, dream it, right now, plan it, focus on, success, do it. This is big, gratitude. These are really nice, I like these. These are unclear and they are just small little like, Headings, encouragement stickers. We've got a page of habit trackers, but these are actually labeled a weekly uh, checklist or it just says habit checklist and then these little button stickers of encouragement. Uh, these strip stickers, these are really nice. Um, however, I don't like when they use a foil font because it seems to get lost on there sometimes. So I don't know, I'd love to hear your thoughts. These little flags are nice, I like those. Inspire, encourage, learn, grow, support, love. That's really pretty, I like all of the decorative on here and the messages. We've got some full boxes that are labeled goal and then they are shaded, um, but they do have like a dot grid. And then we've got some more um, just loving, mindset, vision, dream, learning, growth, rest, and create. Little headers with like, looks like highlighted underneath there. Ooh, what is this? This is a page of, are they boxes, flags, letters? Okay, ooh, we've got flags, okay. Yeah. There are little flags in different colors. All right, those are cute. Oh, this is pretty. I love these colors. This year, big goals, don't forget, priorities. And then, of course, some more little accents down the center. And then we've got some nice wording here, encouraging wording. And the same thing here. Here's the plan, focus on. These are really, really pretty stickers. Um, then we've got another page of that full box. Here's another one that, like what we saw earlier. This is also similar to what we saw earlier, but this one actually has a uh, gold foil lettering in there. Okay, now we've got another page. Now, are these also going to be flags? Yes, these are also the little flags, um, but in like more of the jewel tone colors. Here's some more like decorative boxes, some little encouraging like small ovals on the side. Ooh, this is pretty. Now is this like a strip? Ah, okay, so this is just actually not kiss cut. This is just the design of the sticker book. That is really nice. And then take what you need to succeed. Patience, hope, gratitude, good energy, happiness, inspiration, confidence, encouragement, and pass some along. Okay, that's really cute. Um, habit. This is similar to what we saw in the page earlier where it said goal. And then here's another page of encouraging wording. These little button stickers, little win, yay, go all in, the best. 
uh, right now checklist do the work go all in the best and little win I like those those are cute so little stickers of encouragement for you to put in there top five three goals pay order buy and then do so these are great for us to use in like the finance pages uh, this is a really pretty page. Good things have it equals success. Actually, I can all the things. Uh, girl, you already have what it takes. Always the dreamer stay true. I really like this. It does have the gold foil, but the font is like bold. It's not like small and it's obviously really easy to read. That is beautiful. I love that. Ooh, I like these two details, tasks, checklist and these are just like the little headers here to put on um in the planner those will fit like perfectly like that um share your magic with the world pretty a year from now you'll wish you started today okay this is honestly hard to read i like the saying but that dark um, like purple in the back with that green that was really not that good of a choice <laughs> for design sorry but it is true shoot for the moon darling that's pretty gratitude is the best attitude and then we've got priority these are cute I like that it's got like the little arch there uh, focus and do I'm liking those. All right, so that is everything in the sticker book. Oh, you know, these are really pretty. Really, really pretty. Really like that page, that purple and that blue and those flags. Yeah, nice design here. All right, so that is everything in the Bohemian Brights Life Hack Be Happy Box. Oh my goodness. I don't know why that's such a tongue twister for me. I had to like slow it down in order to say that without getting caught up in my words. Um, but it's really, really pretty. I really like it. Um, it's extremely packed. Like it was very heavy when I got the box. I think it is a great deal. Um, this one right here, this particular one, the Bohemian Brights one, unfortunately is sold out. Again, I do not know if it will be replenished or not, um, but the Apricot Dreams one is available. It has the same contents in it, but in a, just a different color scheme. So if you don't like the brights and you like this idea, then the, that might be perfect for you because it's really, really a nice box set. I believe it's like marked down right now. I am an affiliate of Happy Planner. So if you do pick this up or anything from the Happy Planner, I greatly appreciate if you use my affiliate link. I do have that down below in the description. And I know that they just came out like with their spring release. So there's a lot of beautiful things that they have. I have not even looked at everything myself yet because like I said, there's a lot there to go ahead and look at. I think that this is such a great box. Like everything in here is super useful. I think it would make like a really, really good gift for somebody um, besides, of course, just for yourself. So you get one for you and then you get a gift for somebody else. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much for joining me in today's video. If you like this video, please be sure to give me a thumbs up. Please uh, remember to subscribe if you have not done so already. Drop a comment down below and let me know your thoughts. Like, this is a really nice setup. And is this something that you have already set up for yourself for this year? Like a goal setting system, planner, or do you just maybe have everything like in your existing planner? What's your uh, like goal setting setup looking like for 2024? All right. Thank you so much again for joining me in today's video. And if you watched this video all the way through till the end, give me a thumbs up. Just give me a thumbs up emoji. All right. Thank you so much. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.